Hi there, this is gonna be a general reading for the sign of Aquarius. Hello, fellow Aquas. This is gonna be for November. This is for Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus signs, as well as the cross watcher of the Aquarius. All right, so let's just get a couple cards out first, get a feel of this. I've just done all 12 zodiac signs intimate readings. So if you are bored, want to catch up, then there's a lot to catch up on. Um, we have the Four of Wands. It's two cards, but this one's face down, ass up. So we're going to read this one first. Four of Wands, freedom. I mean, if that's not an aqua, I don't know what is. Aquarians love their freedom. Love her, but leave her wild, right? Is Atticus. Someone here wants to be loved. It's so funny because if you watch me on Instagram, I just talked about this there on XI underscore Missy underscore XI on Instagram. How I want to be in love, right? I want to be in a relationship. I want to be with someone. Yes, of course I do. Yes, absolutely. Yeah. But I want to be alone with someone period. <laughs> you thought I was going to go into some deep shit. No. I want to be alone, but I want someone to be alone with. Uh, freedom. I, I want to be with you, but you need to let me be free too. Now, this doesn't mean that we're not going to commit. We're going to be totally monogamous. Ring on finger, marriage. Yes, of course. But there's this sense of I need to be who I am. Can you deal with that? Because this is me. Take it or leave it. I have to have my freedom too. Not freedom to go run amok. Not freedom to go bouncing on other people. Freedom to have my independence and alone time. Someone here is really worried about that. It's like, it's like, I want to be in a relationship. I want to be with you. I want to fall in love, but I'm scared. Like, are you going to take away what I worked so hard to build? And for a lot of us, it was freedom. A lot of us have been in horrible relationships or, or situations, you know, where we were stuck and we just felt trapped and we weren't free, we were controlled. And now that we have our sense of freedom again, this is a big fucking deal. Four of Wands is also a card of marriage and union. So there is commitment on the table here or there is commitment coming. And it's like having to decide, well, okay, yes, but, yes, but you can't control me and tell me what the fuck to do and think I'm gonna just obey every word you say. Will I be submissive? Only if you're alpha enough to submit to. See, a really intuitive, alpha, awakened man is not gonna to try to control anyone. That would be your first indicator that if you're looking for an awakened man, that ain't it. Four of Pentacles control. It's like you cannot fucking make it up. That's exactly what we're talking about. See, it says control. It's like I'm psychic or something. You cannot control me. I need to do me. I need my freedom. Love me, but leave me wild. It's like a fear someone has, like, I want to be with you in a relationship, but are you going to try to tame me? Now, don't get me wrong. You get together in a relationship, there's this acclimation between the two, right? Compromise, and we've got to acclimate to the other. It's normal, but you don't want to, you, you're not going to control me and tell me what to do, what to say, how to dress. You won't do that. You will be the protector, yes. You will lead. And I may follow, may, because if you lead us somewhere stupid and, and to our demise, I won't. So I won't just follow because you lead. 
I'll follow if I feel you're leading us in the right direction. Because I'm an alpha too, right? So it's two alphas coming together, trying to figure out how to be alpha and sub, submissive. I watched Fifty Shades of Grey last night, all three of them back to back to back. And something in my gut told me to do so. And it was like, here we go. I also watched Pride and Prejudice yet again. I've been watching that nonstop. One of my favorite movies of stories, books, period. Both of them actually. But you know, Pride and Prejudice is a fucking Jane Austen classic, hunty. And so here we are talking about Mr. Grey and Mr. Darcy. Isn't this them too? Control. Wanting to be in control of themselves. Controlling their feelings. Right? One actually both of them just couldn't handle it it just was like i i can't be away from you i love you release me from this torment i'm dying it's torturous so it feels like someone starting to lose control because they cannot get their hands on what they want now that's going to be in love that will also be in career that will be in life in general Someone's patience here is growing thin because they can't get what they want. What the hell is that? Page of Swords, Gossip, and the Three of Cups, Celebrations. Let's give them something to talk about. Oh my God, I love Bonnie Raitt a little mystery to figure out how about love 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 it's like they're gonna talk about us though I, I don't know why this would be your case i don't know if it's because i don't know why what are they gonna say what are they gonna say i keep hearing that what are they gonna think what are they gonna say and it's like who fucking cares I don't live my life for these motherfuckers. Who cares? I'm hearing, let's give them something to talk about. Like, I feel like it's an elephant in the room. Everybody can see it. Everybody knows. Everybody already knows. Yeah, but what are they going to say? Well, who cares the fuck? They already know. It's almost like this obvious thing for some of you. Everybody already knows. It's obvious. Also, for some of you, you're, you've got a lot of successful things happening, right? Three of Cups is celebration in this deck. A lot of people here are talking shit about your success. People always got some slick shit to say. So some of you, they hate you because they ain't you, but they also hate that other people love you. Three of Cups again. Different deck. Seven of Wands. Someone trying to block something, right? I am going to have fun with girls. I, I just talked about this on my live on Instagram. I'm going to go on a girl's trip. No the fuck you ain't. Someone here is trying to control us. Bye bye See you later. See what I'm saying? No. This is, I want to have my freedom still. I'm, I'm trustworthy. And when you tell me, no, I cannot, it insults me because it makes me feel like you're saying I can't be trusted. And that is pissing me off. So you have two energies here, someone who may want to try to control you and someone here who understands that they cannot. The Queen of Cups. I'm crazy for falling. Someone here feels crazy. I'm crazy. I don't know why I'm feeling like this. I'm, it's, it's crazy. It's very, it's very patsy, you know, very crazy for loving you. Someone's crazy in love. Someone feels crazy that, that something, I don't know. Five of pentacles. Feeling abandoned. Queen of pentacles, excuse me, the queen of cups in the past has been abandoned. She has been left. She's been in a place before of you know, being left high and dry. So there is this sense of deep healing that the feminine has had to go through. And then the Ace of Pentacles flies out. That is an offer. And it's a very big one. We like big things. This can mean moving in career change, right? The Ace of Pentacles. But it also, look at the bitch, single as fuck on the bottom of the deck, Nine of Pentacles. 
you can't tell me what the fuck to do. I want to be alone, but I want someone to be alone with. I mean, this is the bitch. Since someone says, hey, I want to be with you. Hey, I'm making my move. Some of you, it was a long-awaited fucking offer. Everybody knows. It's obvious. It's like, what are you waiting for? Love me like you do. It's just, it's so obvious, whatever this is. It's like, <laughs> but also people talking about someone. Maybe someone's in the public eye, so they talk about you. Maybe someone here lives in a small town, so they talk about you, right? Those would be typical reasons. People are jealous, so they talk about you. Nine of Pentacles being single, someone wants to make you theirs. But there's a sense here of control is the basis here. Control. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Control. She doesn't want to be controlled. And then his feelings can't be controlled. And then it's freaking one out. And then the other one's freaking out like, oh my God, am I crazy in love? Maybe it's the masculine feeling that. That I'm crazy in love. It's very Beyonce, crazy in love. Ten of Pentacles. There's an ending here. She might turn them down. She turns on somebody because there's an ending there. King of Cups. I mean, King of Cups can be emotionally mature, right? Could be a water sign, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces. But let me tell you something. This King of Cups energy here is also someone who doesn't necessarily, um, it's not necessarily going to be someone who says that they're in love or tells you or shows it even you see what i'm saying it's th that doesn't necessarily mean that the king of cups feels it and then from there what does he do about it is different for each person but just because a king of cups has feelings doesn't mean he's going to do anything about them Right, so you do have these offers coming in here, but I feel like someone sat on their feelings for a minute and watched and waited and thought, how am I gonna wrangle that one in? That was a wild one. She's crazy. <laughs> She'll say no. She'll tell me to go fuck myself. And you would've. But there's something here about it's time. Like, stop bullshitting, it's time. King of Swords. Could be someone emotionally detached. They don't wear their heart on their sleeve. Someone who's, I mean, that could be Aquarius, right? Aquarius, Gemini, Libra, very, very stoic, logical. Someone here is just trying to not show their feelings. And that didn't work. It didn't work. It's, it worked for a little, but it's not going to work forever. All right, guys, we're going to get into your extended. Should you wish to rent it, click that upside down triangle below. Brings up the description page here on YouTube and all my info is there. First link would be to my website, saltwaterhistarial.com. Second link is to my Patreon. If you love erotic tarot readings, I do them there on Patreon, you guys. There's a whole shitload of videos on Patreon that, you know, you can't watch anywhere else. It's, exclu it's exclusive content there. So follow me there. And reminder, I am completely fully booked. I am not accepting any more requests except for the occasion emergency session emergency readings are $200 for 30 minutes live phone call booked within usually about seven days of payment um, other than that I'm booked I have not finished everyone yet I did not forget about you if you booked a reading with me haven't heard back yet trust me I am working my way down the list okay please be patient all in divine timing mm, peacock bracelets as well as magic moon water are going to be going out very soon if you ordered a Lilith bracelet and a peacock and a magic moon water or just a lilith bracelet all those that purchase a lilith bracelet your orders are not going to be going out yet until another maybe like two weeks it's just because lilith's not ready yet so if your order contains a lilith bracelet not yet okay lilith wants to go out in scorpio season i mean this is just it's been pushed back some of the, the items were out of stock for the bracelet it's just this thing like scorpio 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 and that is lilith so that is the update that we have magic moon water is going out and peacock if you've only ordered those items okay remember now malachite was um not going out because lilith is taking the place of malachite anyways Thank you for your likes your shares and your subscriptions here on youtube thank you all for your donations i appreciate them so much thank you for watching all of my ads on all of my videos because that does add to my monetization and i appreciate each and every one of you you guys okay so i'll see you in the extended 
and this is going to be oh sorry it's going to be in the november extended readings for this one um since we are doing november's so november see you there bye